So, the way that normally, I, when it's one of the mod's birthdays, if their birthday falls on a day that I stream, I will let them choose a race to do. Like, they can choose whatever we do on GTA, whatever race they want, whatever car. Um, and it was Rainbow's birthday on Wednesday, but I didn't stream on Wednesday. But I should have been streaming on Wednesday. I just, it was, it was uh, cancelled. So I guess I, you know, I owe him a race. And he told me the race that he wants to see. And I'm not happy about it. I did make an error. It was a significant error of judgment. He wants a rally on Project Homecoming in the Habanero role. This video is brought to you by you. Thank you so much for simply being here and enjoying my content. Please do leave a comment, like the video, and consider subscribing if you haven't already for a chance to see your name here in a future video. So we're all going to enjoy this, everybody, in the session. Yeah, have, have fun. <laughs> but he didn't specify which kind of rally, so I can go for a really short one, which is exactly what I'm planning to do. Let's do East Alamo rally. <laughs> What's the shortest rally we have? Yeah, everyone thinking the same thing. <laughs> His DMs are open to your feedback. I know, right? These idiots have been hot lapping the cutter for days. Is that why I'm seeing cutters? Because people have actually been hot lapping the cutter. <laughs> okay, yeah, the Project Homecoming crowd are mad. Zero off road traction loss, though, so clearly a rally car. That's true, the Habanero has zero off road traction loss. Said this earlier, but you missed it. Remember Mirror 2005 that you host Ruiner 2000s on? I do remember. Electric Toaster has decided to try to complete that track in other regular cars and has delved in an impromptu hot lap challenge of Mirror 2005 in Cutters. It is a moment of all time. No way. It's not even that you're doing it on some, like, normal track. You're... You're doing Mirror 2005, where you have to jump up and you know jump over things and parachute using the Ruiner 2000, using the Ruiner 2000, and you've all delved into hot lapping it in the cutter. We are indeed idiots. This target time is sub nine minutes. Oh my god! I guess I'll just leave the chat on for this one. Raymo, I'm not happy about this. I'm going to make it my mission to not... <laughs> I was going to say not roll it and I almost did immediately. <laughs> I guess it's easy to forget how easy it is to roll it. You dropped the logs, environmental obstacle. Did I drop the logs? <laughs> no. This all stemmed from one round of the multi-class endurance championship. Was it season three? Where the Habanero was the GT, the Habanero was the GT2 car for the SUVs round. And people kept rolling it because it's just naturally meant to roll. Obviously there was a meme made of it, and that's why we have the Habanero roll. Something that I might learn from this is that I don't know how to drive the Habanero roll quickly. Because I'm losing a lot of time. There's obviously a trick. No, no. I don't think anyone spent enough time in it to really dial it in, do you think? I mean... Is this me starting one of these ridiculous... Oh, we've seen, we've got... People are, are rolling it. You lose a lot more time rolling it. That's, that's the key. The key is to not roll it. Doesn't matter if you're quick in it. You just need to not roll it. I've immediately gone to second place just through virtue of... I was slow, but I haven't rolled it yet, so... <laughs> there it goes. 
No, no. Yeah, maybe maybe I'm the next one to start uh, to to start the next stupid trend on Project Homecoming. This the best time in this rally with a habanero roll. <laughs> Let's put it this way, I won't be doing it again. Unless we happen to fall on one of the mods' birthdays again and they, get, they force me to. See, Mild's doing alright. This is the difference when it comes to the random alls and stuff. Your Mild's and your Locks of the world know how to drive the really difficult cars as well, quickly. It's trying to get it up. It's trying to get that leg up. <laughs> Limp Biscuit's ride of choice. We're alright. We're alright. Ooh. I've had some really close moments. I'm, I'm pushing it a little bit and then I realize I'm about to roll it and then I stop pushing it. Someone's upside down up in front. <laughs> Listen, you can all blame Raymo for this. It was his choice. It was his mod race decision. I think the key to be quick is keeping all four wheels on the ground. I know that sounds obvious. <laughs> but like, it's probably significantly quicker to like really, really slow down. Crazy idea, I know. As long as you're keeping, you know, contact with all four wheels. Okay, I don't need to let anyone behind me pass. I've passed them all. They, 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 they blue flagged me. My birthday is on a Sunday this year. Oh, God damn it. The, the, the mod's birthday has to fall on the day that I would be streaming. I stream three days a week though, so three out of seven chats. Queens in Vamos sounds good to me. Hammer, please. Think about this. Like, you scared a roll out of me. I was doing so well. <laughs> I got so far without one. I don't think I lost too much. Well, maybe, what? Four seconds or something from that roll. I'm pretty pleased I got so far. I got a long way without rolling it. It was the most gentlest of rolls. It was. Hey, that wasn't too bad. I think I, again, me doing well in rallies. Even stupid rallies that Raymore makes me do. Just the one roll. We'll see where we finish. Might not be too bad. This was boring. A stipulation for next time should be that you're not allowed to use the brakes. No. I disagree with that wholeheartedly. 
currently in third. <laughs> Chaos. Don't say yes. Don't don't encourage them. <laughs> you you lot just want the one amalgamation of all the worst memes. Have an air roll that speeds up when you break, that turns left when you turn right. Like just put them all together. That's that's the only thing. You know, there's no nuance. <laughs> also negative off for attraction and horrible toll values for sentient steering. <laughs> And square wheels. <laughs> Sentient negative brake boost dock stance habanero. <laughs> That's what you lot want. It's the one worst car. Contains all the worst parts of all the all the cars. All the memes. Chat's really cooking with some stellar ideas this morning. I disagree. I do not want to see that. Ooh, we're still in the top ten. I feel like I'm going to stay there. Without the roll, I think I might have been in the 7 to 8 range. I don't think I, I was nowhere near a top 5. That was as, wasn't as painful as it could have been. Also bring in the one hit damage. <laughs> and really long habanero rule. Let's not. Okay, I've created the habamination with the habanero stability, sentient vamos tour and brake boost filter brakes. Wish me luck. Jesus. Catalyst, why are you doing this? Uh, so, I have a question. Catalyst. The thing that you made, what, what's it like? <laughs> it's something, it's quite something. Can, can, can we try it? <laughs> you know what, screw it, give me a moment, it's happening. It's happening, we're gonna try it. <laughs> I don't know how good of an idea this is, but you know. Finishing it off uh finishing it off nicely. I feel like I feel like this is the, the perfect ending to uh, what we've the the, the the common thread that's gone all the way through this stream. The pinnacle of crowdsourced design. <laughs> yeah. Literally just all of the opinions of everyone in the chat all coming together in one thing. <laughs> it's the habanero with the sentient vamos tour values and brake boost felts of brakes. <laughs> okay. 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 Okay, it's it's uncontrollable. On the upside if you hit the brakes you'll go straight. Is that right? It's uncontrollable! That's true. You go straight if you if you do brake boosts. If you hit the brakes. You at least go straight. <laughs> you asked for this. I... 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 I was peer pressured by the chat. You I didn't. I didn't ask for it anyway. You made it. The chat gave you all these ideas. You're the one who took it upon yourself to actually see what it would be like. <laughs> you just... <laughs> with the sentient vamos tour values making it, like, impossible to drive straight, it's just, it's just a mess. <laughs> okay. Okay. I could have just gone, hey, that's crazy, and deleted the files. You wanted this. This is on you. <laughs> you can't give me the you can't give me the option though, can you? <laughs> Benny's put in the chat as if it's a showcase. This is the Emperor Habamination, recently created by Catalyst. <laughs> the showcase is coming full circle. Thank you for the shock. Alright, we're racing it. We have to. Oh man. The, the grid being so close is just going to exacerbate all the problems. What's a good lap time in this on your track? We're about to find out, I think. How much for an only Fred for this? No, it, there's, there's no, there's no amount. Look at the state of this. <laughs> Everybody flipped. 
Oh man. It reminds me of the first time we raced the faction. I can't I can't get I can't get back there we go. Nope, no, no. <laughs> Oh my god, there's just cars everywhere. It's freaking impossible. It's that combination of the, the Sentium Vamos spearing you off on its own with the Habanero giving you no control over, like, you've got no control over where you go. You can't brake to slow down because the brakes make you go faster. And then you've got the Habanero on top of that, which flips at the slightest little turn. <laughs> Oh my god. It's the perfect car. Good job, Catter and Chad. I'm not sure about that. I'm not sure about that praise. <laughs> Look, I keep breaking to try to control it. People are going so slow. <laughs> Look at the map. Look at the map. People are so slow. <laughs> crawling along this really is crowdsourced memery this is why project homecoming don't take meme suggestions from people because it's all stupid <laughs> imagine if it had also been the doc hermes i know right i think that requires a bit more finesse because it's actually swapping the wheels like it swaps the, the back and the front wheels or something to make the doc hermes yeah that would be a nightmare if every little movement you have to do the opposite direction. See, that's the thing. You put a little bit of pace on with the the brakes. It does make you go straight, but as soon as you come off the brakes, you're back spearing off all over the place again, and then you just roll it. So the the best the, the really the only way to do it is to go really slow like this. And then just try to manage the sentientness of the steering. But if you, you've got to go slow enough that you're not you're not gonna roll it when the sentient Vamos steering does its thing. Why doesn't this have Jenny Rumpo suspension? <laughs> Negative off-road traction loss, Jenny Rumpo suspension. Yeah, maybe we're tapping them. Yeah. No, no. See, as soon as you pick up a little bit of speed. <laughs> yeah, it could be made orders of magnitude worse. With it, taking all of the memes together. This is bad enough. I'm just going to do it. I'm just going to go for it. Get out of the way! <laughs> Go! <laughs> and then, then gone. Come on, get the checkpoint. Get the checkpoint. No, I missed it! You've got to commit to the brakes going faster. Because you are guaranteed to roll it immediately afterwards. God, you think the habanero roll is bad on its own? This is just something else. <laughs> ah, the, the, the Vamos steering really does. I mean, I just recently retested the Vamos for the muscle cars video. And like the sentient Vamos, it's not actually that much worse than the real thing. Just a horrible machine. 
Like I tested the tulip and the vamos together and they both have a very similar problem. But at least with the tulip, it's unpredictable. It's it's predictable with its unpredictability. It'll it'll veer off on whatever side of, of the car you hit with a bump. So you can kind of figure it out. Whereas the Vamos, it just goes wherever it wants. <laughs> Damn, Bahanatoth dominated. Jasper truck, new lap record, I'm going for it. Go! I <laughs> just needed to get the checkpoint. Oh, I can do it again straight away. Go! <laughs> that's the that's the trick. That's the trick. And we can keep doing it as long as we're lined up for the next checkpoint. That's what the top two must have been doing, surely. Okay, this time I was able to use the handprint. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Oh, come on! Oh, please! No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, well, at least I got it. What's the lap record? 2 minutes 47. Still quicker than some of the things I've taken around this track, to be fair. Alright, nice and easy. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Let's get lined up. No, no, no. There we go. There we go. Let's go. <laughs> oh, I've stopped perfectly. I can get an extra bit of... Come on. Don't need to respawn. No, oh, come on, please. Give, give me it. Give me it. Let me have this lap be finished. I want this over now. <laughs> come on. Oh, thank God. PB. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, we got a new lap record. What is it? Two minutes 42 now. <laughs> yes. Thank you, Catalyst, for creating this. Thank you and also not thank you. It really was a, an, an interesting period. It was nice to, to actually see this in action though. This is this is only the amalgamation of three different memes as well. There's, there's so many others that could be added. <laughs> we created a monster today. A monstrosity was made. I don't think there's enough G-Fred spirit in the world. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah.